If you'd like to spider a site with OWASP, SAP, or ZAttack proxy, first be sure to proxy your traffic through ZAP. So in this case, I'm using the Matilda Day website as my target, and I have Foxy Proxy configured to send the traffic through ZAP on localhost port 8080. You can also just configure Firefox to proxy directly to ZAP through its network settings. So over here, we have ZAP listening for that traffic. So for example, if I go to some page and then go back to ZAP, down here in the history, you'll notice that every time I visit another page that has a different URL, it just gets added into the history at the bottom. But of course, manually browsing through the pages can be pretty tedious. So what you can do is you can right click on the site or even the subfolders and say spider. So for example here I clicked on the site itself but if you just wanted to go from a certain folder and start from there you could just right click on the folder and the same option would be available. In this case I'm just going to go ahead and spider the entire site. So I'm going to say localhost tack and spider. So it'll give you the starting point. Here again you have the option to change what you want the starting point to be. So again, you could pick like a subfolder to start from. And then you want to say start scan. And Zap is going to use a couple of different ways to figure out pages that it can browse to inside of the site. So one way is it'll follow any kind of links, such as the links that are in the menu. And another way is if it sees a form, it'll try to fill it out. And the resulting page from filling out the form may be a different page, like some kind of success page or login or something like that, and you'll see those appear in the history as well. So when it gets done, you'll see all the new pages under their respective folder in the site. And then you can actually take a look at the requests and responses by clicking on those individual pages. So if we click on the robots.txt, we can see the request and then the response that came back.